Hey, uh, I think we should take a moment. Let's open this loot crate, shall we? Yeah. yeah. Let's see what's in it. Here you go. Once again, thank you to LootCrate.com. You could go to LootCrate.com slash Mega64 and see for yourself. I was going to use this to cut it, but no, that's gross. No, it's all, no, I got it. It was got a cake-covered screwdriver. Were you screwing a cake together? What's no, I actually don't know what happened because that's a tool we really do use. We've used it for our drones, and someone stabbed it into the cake. Was it Brian? You, I don't know, but that wasn't really cool. Are you screwing a cake together? Why is that covered in frosting? American Pie? Why is it still on the table? I was rebooting American Pie. I was screwing a cake. <laughs> Sean, do a drum roll. He screws and a pie. Have, and cut to, uh, what's he screws a, In American Pie, he screws a pie, so you're either in American Cake screwing a cake. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Just want to... All right. Now go ahead. If you're screwing a cake, the movie's American Cake. Doing my best, okay? <laughs> Try, harder. Try harder. Sean, cut all his comments out. All right. <laughs> LootCrate.com slash Mega64. You can go and subscribe and you get a box of stuff every month. Two words, one finger, you and your Loot Crate. Cut out when he mentioned Loot Crate, because we like Loot Crate. No, that was to you. Oh, okay. But thank you, LootCrate.com slash Mega64. Go, and you get a good deal. You get stuff every month. I have a feeling, I don't know what the theme is. I think this is going to be a winner. I think this is going to be the best one yet. Let <laughs> <laughs> me help you, buddy. All right. Sorry. A little See flustered. You. He got, ooh. All right. Ooh, what a shirt. Ooh, alien. Ooh, X. Whoa. What the fuck? It's a it, face hugger. It's a cute face hugger. That was worth it just on its own. Garrett, we got a cute face hugger. Oh, is it plush? It's a fa it's a plush. Is it plushy? Face hugger. There's hey. Hey Derek, just so you know, there's another piece in there that keeps it on your face. Not not in that little bag in the loot crate. Oh, it, oh it, you're it, right. this is like an X file shirt. Like they're getting abducted or something. Oh, look at that. You have a classic gray up there at the top, and then oh. the saucer like shapes. Dang. Is that Mulder and Scully in a silhouette I think there? So. Look at that. Boom. Fight the future, baby. Dang. You think that's a classic gray alien? You don't think that's one of the green aliens? No, I think that's the classic gray. You see the large cranium with the. I think the that's characteristic of the green aliens too, and the whole oh. thing is green for the dramatic effect. Well, I don't know. Dude. I've never heard of no green. Are you talking about like Nibiru stuff? All right, real talk. I don't know green aliens. Oh, aliens are real, and it's been proved on the internet. And if you Google search it, you will find out about every alien there is. Green yep. aliens, gray aliens, aliens do exist. Are, are Norse brother aliens, and yeah. uh, of course the reptiles. Reptilians. The, yeah. rep the reptiles. Well, they're running the country. Um, hey, and your, fa your Facebook phone's gonna hear you. You should stop. Yeah, yeah, don't say Illuminati. Don't contact. show this to Facebook. And I'm making don't... contact. Okay, so that's in there. There's a legit licensed X-Files LED flashlight. Oh, sick. And that's it's cool. water resistant, and it's got an anti-shock switch. So that's aluminum uh -uh. and LED. That's uh, great. Space Invaders vinyl figure. That's cool. Space Invaders. I like that. Oh, and then, that's oh, sick. Oh, what's up? What's that? New Dallas uh, multi -fest. Fifth element... Multipass. Oh, that's cool. Lilu Dallas Multipass. I've still never seen that movie. You What? Never seen it. Wow, I, you get that reaction. You know what? I wonder yeah. if Rocco would like it or hate it. It's like, it's right on the line. Every time I'm about to see it, it's off of whatever service I was just about to watch Hey, Garrett, if you don't want that, can I have I it? I feel like you would either... I did want it, but... Yeah, I mean, you'd if, love if it you or want hate it. Source. And I think you might love it. It, it. In a way, it reminds me of Super Mario Brothers the movie. Just in really? kind of like the gonzo-ness of it. Okay. But the story's better. There's also you know who some... loves it? Tommy. Yo, yeah, it's Tommy one of Tommy a big fan favorite movies. Of the, of oh, there's that. some prints in here. Of like, This is all sci-fi stuff. There's some mini prints, uh, art prints of War of the Worlds. And uh, one of my favorites, the original, not that remake shit, The Day the Earth Stood Still. Oh, that's Klaatu, cool. Barada, Nick Next 2. Time. I haven't seen it in a long time. But... <clears throat> anyway. Anyway, that's a... Hey, that was a good crate. Thank you. I was right. I was right. This is one of the best ones. It good really, it, it, actually, this might be the best this is, loot crate. It, honestly, this oh, consistently this is, all the stuff was pretty good. This might be the best one. Yeah. So if you didn't already have loot crate, you missed out on the best one. Sorry. Yeah, you did. Sorry, fuck you. You should have listened to us last week when yeah. we told you. Exactly. Tried to tell you, but you didn't listen. Tried to told you, stupid ass. Stupid ass internet, internet soldier. Anyway, well, there you go, everybody. So, Sean, um, I don't know what you're supposed to do at this point. Um, you didn't get anything from the loot crate, so 
try to do a prediction video on what the next loot crate could be. Um, yeah. Edit together some possibilities. Probability of what they would be, like the, the odds, like 15 to 1 or, you know, whatever. Um, I'm gonna have to move that though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, whoever wrote it in the yeah. chat, fuck you! <laughs> awesome! He didn't even fucking yeah, know it! He had no idea! He didn't fucking know it! He wrote it! I noticed yep. it as soon as he did it. Peanut like, Jesus! I just had to fight it. You fuck! They fucked you, it. dude. Well, anyway, that does it for our show this week. I think that's it. So, any, uh, any final thoughts? Again, oh. stay tuned because we have so much new stuff on the way that it's ridiculous. Um, and, uh, we are, uh, really, again, grateful for everybody who supported us. Thanks again, one and all. I, uh, I just noticed something about the face hugger. I always knew the face hugger was two hands put together like that. Yeah, kind of, yeah. yeah. It is, it is. When you look at, uh, when you, this one doesn't really show it, but when you look at the actual face hugger, these tentacles look like really elongated fingers. They have fingernails on them. It's basically like that. But it wasn't until this thing was on my face right here, my peripheral, it's two nuts and a penis yeah. Yeah. dangling off the bottom of two hands. Yeah, that's so, Geiger for you. Class, gotta, classic Hans Rudy. Gotta be uh, anyways. phallic. Anyways, I always knew it was two hands, but now I see the complete beast is two hands plus male genitals. Dick and balls. Yeah. Literally the scariest thing in the entire universe. Speaking, speaking of dick and balls, don't forget, Kevin and Brian are bringing them. They're going to be at PAX South. 